Hey guys, I don't really have anything to talk about right now, so um, I guess I'm going to talk about volunteering. I have no clue why I went on to this topic, but uh, yeah. I have volunteered in two places. I haven't had any jobs yet, and um, the two pl places I've volunteered for is the Living Arts Center and for PLASP. I'm going to start talking about PLASP right now. I don't know how long this video is going to be, and if I still have time and I don't exceed four minutes, I'm going to talk about the Living Arts Center as well. Okay, so because I'm talking about class, but I'm not going to mention the school that I volunteer at or any of the kids by name, um, just for safety reasons and privacy and all that. And I just don't want any, of, don't want myself or them to get in trouble for what I'm doing. PLASP is an after-school program for kids whose parents uh, work and do stuff, and they're not able to pick them up right after school. So it's for like little kids, and I get to enjoy hanging out with people from kindergarten to about grade four or five, but it's the school that I'm going to, that's generally the uh, age range for me. Uh, hopefully next year I'm going to volunteer again and I'm going to go with the smaller kids and it's going to be a lot of fun. So yeah, it's basically a volunteering opportunity to work with kids as I've said before and uh, basically what you do is, well, basically what I do is I come there, I come around 3 or 5-ish, uh, it's once a week. Uh, Right after I finish school, I come, I help prepare food and stuff like that. The kids come in, they say hi, they wash, they put their stuff away, wash their hands, they come sit down, they eat. Afterwards, we basically just play games, usually in the gym. And uh, if we have enough time, we come back uh, to the room and we play just like card games and stuff like that. It's a pretty interesting program. It's a lot of fun. Um, the kids that I work with, Working with kids can be a challenge at times, and it's uh, quite interesting to work with them, but um, once you get the hang of it, once they start uh, understanding how you are and you understand how they are, it's actually a really cool opportunity to work with kids. At the beginning, they weren't actually sure of like how they should act with me and stuff like that, but now it's been a couple months since I've been volunteering there, and whenever I come in, they they always smile and they run up to me, give me a hug at the very, very beginning, which is very, very sweet. Um, we talk, we hang out, uh, they tend to talk to me about just about everything, and it's quite nice uh, volunteering with them. There are times when uh, the kids aren't exactly... There are some kids who aren't exactly the most well-behaved, or um, there are kids who are there that aren't exactly the most well-behaved, or... Um, the nicest people there, but uh, they tend to work out nicely. Uh, basically what happens is the teacher tends to deal with them a little bit more and I tend to take care of the rest of the kids. Uh, we split up everything. I sit down with the kids while they're eating, talk to them, see how they're doing, see what they want to do. Uh, we, when we go to the gym, we they have to sit down in a circle. They're quite hyper, so that doesn't end up well. But uh, it just works. It's a really nice opportunity to work with kids. And if you really enjoy working with kids and want to be in an environment where you can influence and help them, it's probably the best thing you could do. Um, I, when I started volunteering here, uh, there I wanted to become a child psychologist. So it was kind of the perfect opportunity to work with kids and stuff like that. Currently, I'm thinking about doing something uh, more with like older kids and stuff like that. Um, I'm just going to see how it goes. Um, but yeah, that's just about it. But yeah, other than that, uh, I'm really happy that you're enjoying English. And I am very excited for you to, uh, for you to be going to China. I am quite jealous, and um, hopefully your trip is going to be really good. Other than that, Joe, I'll see you tomorrow. Bye, guys.